guys, today I'm going to be showing you my Slime Bash gifts and trades that I did while I was there. I'm so excited to show you everything that I got. I got so many great ones, not just these. You guys gifted me some while I was there too, if you were there. And um, I also have another event coming up very soon. I'm going to Slime Mania. That's going to be in Anaheim, California. It's going to be awesome. And I promise you I'm going to do better at vlogging this time because I tried to vlog Slime Bash 2. And I was a little disappointed. I should have got a lot more footage for you guys because I wanted you to feel like you're there. So I'm definitely going to be doing that this time. Anyways, if you're excited for this video, please hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and welcome to my channel. Also, don't forget to follow me at wishuponastarslimeshop. No. <laughs> don't forget to follow me at wishuponastarslimeshop on Instagram because I do so much more cool stuff there. I'm always as active as possible. You'll see behind the scenes in my life if you want to see that. Lots of crazy stuff happens with my family, I promise. <laughs> but anyways, please go follow me there as well. And let's get right into the slime opening. The first package I'm showing you guys was given to me at Slime Bash from Krabby Slimes. They gave me a scent inside the package, an 8 ounce slime and a 6 ounce slime. And the first one that I'm going to show you is called Pink Sandy Beaches. Oh my gosh, you guys, I love this cloud slime so much. The recipe was perfection. For being such a smaller and underrated account, I was very impressed. And I loved the scent. Very tropical and perfumey smelling. I loved it. Next up is called Ocean Sweets. This one was an 8 ounce with a lot of glitter inside. It was a nice thick clear slime texture. And it had a really cute gummy bear charm inside too. Thank you so much, Krabby Slimes. This next slime was given to me from Sanderson Slimes, and I'm pretty sure it was like a 16 ounce. It was really big. This was a really cool cloud slime texture. I love the mix of colors that they put into here and the colorful sprinkles as well. It was so fun to watch the colors mix. I love slimes like this. And it has kind of like a chocolatey scent. I'm pretty sure it was a Halloween themed slime because this was around Halloween time. So sorry that I took this long to upload the video, by the way, you guys, and half the video, my nails are super ugly, and half the video, they're kind of nice, so just a fair warning. <laughs> This next one is a 4 ounce called Marshmallow Fluff from Tropica Slimes and it wasn't scented but it was nice and glossy and it made some great bubble pops. This is another 6 ounce slime from another Krabby Slimes, which is kind of funny. It's not the same Krabby Slimes. But anyways, it's called Frozen Treats and it's a thick and glossy slime with a little bit of beads inside and some glitters. It had a really yummy scent. I'm almost positive it was a cheesecake. If you're here, let me know Krabby Slimes. This next one is one of the trades that I did at Slime Bash with Slime by Jacqueline, also known as Nicole Jacqueline. And if you're watching my video, then most likely you know who she is because she's pretty popular on YouTube. So anyways, this is an 8 ounce slime. It has a really great cloud cream texture, which is one of my favorite textures. And I don't know what the name of this one was, but it has an orange creamsicle scent that's super yummy. And I loved it. This next one is a 3 ounce slime that was given to me from Basketball Slimes. They were actually my neighbors at Slime Bash and they are a brother and sister team. They are super sweet kids and I highly recommend that you check out their shop. This is I believe a butter or clay slime texture with rainbow sprinkles inside and I really liked it you guys. Good job. This next one is a 6 ounce slime from Slimy Sammy called Maple Nut Waffles. They were actually my other Slime Bash neighbors. They were also super sweet and they ended up doing a trade with me at the end of the event. The funny thing is I was actually eyeballing this slime the whole time because I'm a big fan of anything like waffle or pancake scented. So I was really excited to get this. 
It had a great scent as expected. It had super cute brown glitters inside to represent cinnamon. And it had a super unique like thick and jiggly texture. I really liked it a lot. This next one is part of a trade I did with Marissa, also known as Parakeet Slimes. I know you guys gotta know her. She's super popular and she makes awesome slimes. If you're wondering if Parakeet Slimes is overrated, honestly you guys, she's not. Like her slimes are just amazing. This one was super thick and glossy and the scent was perfect. This next one is an 8 ounce also from Marissa and honestly you guys this is my favorite slime like ever I think. This is Froyo Flome and oh my goodness it provides the best crunches. The scent is amazing and I can't stop playing with this one. I still play with it on a daily basis honestly. <laughs> This next slime I got from Borax Buddy Slimes at Slime Bash and it came with a 6 ounce pumpkin flapjacks and a, I believe it's like a 2 ounce of the maple syrup. Oh my goodness you guys this gets the award for the most creative and cutest slime ever because it was so much fun putting the syrup on the pancake. It also came with a little clay piece of butter. Like how much better can it get? <laughs> Anyways, the scent was also on point. It smelled like pumpkin and cinnamon and maple syrup and it was just so yummy. Like the only other thing I'd like to do is be able to eat it and then it would be perfect. <laughs> Next is Borax Buddies Iconic Pot Pie Slime. This is their best selling slime that a lot of people have recreated videos of over and over because I mean look at it. It looks so amazing. It's, it looks just like pot pie. Um, the scent is kind of like an apple cinnamon scent which is pretty cool. Call me weird but I would have liked to see like a, like a chicken or actual pot pie scent on it. But that's just me. I'm into savory slime so I don't mind a savory scent. Overall though, it was an amazing slime, amazing texture, and made lots of awesome bubble pops. This next slime I got from my friend Amanda, also known as the Slime Hive. It's a five ounce and it's called Slime Bash Ice Cream. It was super cute with the two colors, the green and the purple, which are two of my favorite colors. And it also had the matching sprinkles to go with it, which went perfect with the ice cream theme. It was also very buttery and smooth and spreadable and it just was perfect. I couldn't ask for more in a slime. This next one is a six ounce slime that I got in a trade that I did with Tammy from my slime obsession. And you guys, she is the clear slime queen in my opinion. She makes some beautiful clear slimes. If you like those, I recommend that you go check out her shop. This one was perfect with everything coordinating in yellow. The, the foam beads, the glitters, and those fish bowls. It was very vibrant and pretty to look at. The name was Wallflower, which I thought was super cute. And Tammy, the owner of this shop, is just wonderful. She's such a sweet person. So that always makes slimes even better to know that it came from a nice, loving <laughs> slime maker. I got this next one in a trade that I did with Slime Vida. It's a six ounce. It's called Una Pumpkin. And guys, this one was so cute. I was so sad that I lost the toppings. Like, actually, not toppings on the slime, but they were on the outside of the... The lid of the container, it had like a unicorn horn and flowers and it was super pretty but I packed it in my luggage and it all fell off unfortunately so I couldn't show it to you here. But anyways, this was a beautiful cloud slime, super creative and the makers behind this uh, slime are Capri and her mom, they're a mother-daughter duo and they're super sweet people. 
I got this next slime from the slime queen herself, my friend Karina Garcia. This one's called Mrs. Oreo and I loved it you guys. It was a perfectly thick and glossy slime. If you like thick and glossies, you will love this. But unfortunately, I don't think you can get it unless you go to an event that she's at because she only does her own handmade slimes exclusively at events. So I was really excited to be able to get my hands on this one. This next slime is one that I got from Squishy Bunny. It's a six ounce, it's called Birthday Flome. For those of you who don't already know, he's Karina Garcia's soon to be husband. I believe this is one of his best selling slimes and I definitely can see why. It has um, small microphone beads inside. It also has some bigger ones and the ones that are colorful are really nice and vibrant. The scent of birthday cake that they use in this is really nice and it's just super crunchy. So if you like crunchy slimes, you're going to like this slime. This is another trade I did at Slime Bash with Elaine from The Bomb Slime. She was super nice, you guys. Um, that's another thing that I really like about going to slime events is that you get to meet the people behind the slime. And a lot of times they're super nice. Sometimes they'll trade with you, but if they don't, they have awesome prices at events. Like... Usually you can get a 6 to an 8 ounce for 10 bucks. I mean, can you beat that pricing? Also, you don't have to pay for the shipping. But anyways, back to this slime. It was super thick, creamy, and glossy. I loved it so much. The scent on it was really nice. It really did have like a homemade ice cream scent, nice and sweet. And yeah, she doesn't call herself the bomb slime for no reason. She makes some pretty bomb slime. <laughs> These next two slimes were gifted to me from Mermaid Slimes at Slime Bash and this first one is a six ounce called Candy Corn Crunch. I loved the use of all the different candy corn and sprinkles and all the coordinating colors inside. Um, it also had a really good candy corn scent and it was super crunchy. The next slime they gave me was another six ounce called Poison Berry Pie. And you guys, this one gets the award from me for the cutest Halloween themed slime. I mean, look at it. It had this really nice purple uh, clear slime base. It also had these different colored foam beads inside that were really great Halloween colors. And it had googly eyes, which was super funny because while I was playing with it, I thought I heard a, like a kind of like a noise from the eyeballs. So I shook it and I, it definitely gave me a little little extra ASMR in there with the googly eyes. It was super funny. I really liked this slime. Thank you guys. Next slime is a six ounce that was gifted to me from Slimy Pellets. They are super cool people. Um, this one's called Japanese Cream Soda. The colors inside were my favorite. I love baby blues and greens. And it was a really nice glossy and uh, bubble poppy slime. It also had a really yummy scent. So that's it for my gifts, trades, and purchases from Slime Bash. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. I am so excited to be done with this voiceover. And I will see you guys very soon in the next video. I promise you, have a super blessed day. Bye, guys.